The guys that, that I was uh, influenced by, they all played P basses. Well, I first started playing, I got assigned bass by my friend who was a guitar player and wanted to start a band. I took to it right away. I was a, this is in the early 80s and I was a huge police fan and it was pretty easy to, to embrace the idea of playing bass if uh, you're a Sting fan. This bass here, which is going to be my signature uh, model, is uh, basically modeled after a 71 P bass. One of the first basses I had, the first one that was any any good, really. I got it in probably uh, 1987, something like that, and it came from the East Coast. I bought it for $200. Instead of experimenting with a thousand different basses, uh, I, I stuck to it. So I played that thing exclusively from 87 or 88 when I got it until the, the mid-90s, probably. All the time I was in San Diego Real Estate, uh, all the punk, punk kind of hardcore bands I was in before that, it's the first probably two or three Foo Fighters records, almost exclusively that bass, and then, you know, had a couple other basses I'd play every once in a while, but I always ended up going back, back to that one. I didn't really know what I was getting into at the time. Back in the, back in the 80s, these, you know, multi-thousand dollar vintage uh, P basses were just, they were just everywhere. However many years later, 20 plus, plus years later, it's, it's sort of too valuable to take out on the road, for me personally, because it's such a part of my history and I love it so much. And, but now, I have a whole bunch of them to choose from. We got the final product today, which is uh, exactly what I wanted. Fender was great and, and uh, took the bass and found a way to, to copy the shape of the neck. It had this, this great low action, it felt really good, it was light and it was resonant and it, just, it sounded great and uh, was this cool uh, kind of dark candy apple red color. It had a rosewood fret, fretboard, which I ended up really preferring. I love it. This is the perfect bass for me. It's, uh, I think it looks good. It's got all of the upgraded technology bits. This is going to make it sound good. It's good bridge, awesome pickups, uh, nice resonant wood for the body. I'm, I'm super excited about it. It's great. Once you've landed on a P bass, it's kind of, it's kind of where you, where you stay. Mm -hmm.